So it's a great blessing to have a warrior spirit like Habib in the Muslim community. Muslims have been thrown to the ground all over the world. We have a lot of places where they've been battered upon by armies that have much superior forces. And unfortunately, there's a lot of suffering. So there's, it's, it's not surprising that people, that they feel uplifted when they see Habib throw down people that trash talk our religion and, and feel like shouting out Allahu Akbar. I was thinking about trash talking him until I watched him fight Conor McGregor. Then I changed my mind. <laughs> So, my son, because we're Irish, my sons are half Mexican, half Irish. But because we're Irish, one of my sons actually was a Conor McGregor fan until he saw that a Muslim was going to fight him, and then he switched sides. And that's proof that faith trumps clan. And that's one of the powers of our religion is that we give up nationalism for something greater, which is the spirit. So I wouldn't dare trash talk Habib. I actually just gave him a hug and I felt like I was hugging a rod of iron. <laughs> so he actually squeezed me to check me out. And so I'm gonna go home and start lifting some weights. So the next time I see him. So anyway, Alhamdulillah. It's a great blessing to be here. I really hope that people take these words to heart that we need to really encourage, especially our young people. So many young kids now are just playing these ridiculous games, wasting their life. We see so many overweight young people now. When I was young, you never saw overweight young people. It was very rare. But now there's so many overweight young people, which is very unhealthy. And over time, it gets worse and worse. So it's really important to have your kids train. Uh, I had my boys go to a Korean, uh, up to the black belt, the older ones, because I really believe in that. And uh, 